this. So you can just about see it lighting. There doesn't seem to be a moving magnet in here. So what's going on? You got a coil. There is a coil in there. It's a coil, coil around the magnet. And there's a magnet inside in the middle. Okay, so it's a coil moving around a magnet. Same idea. Electromagnetic induction. The same thing happens here. Electromagnetic induction. I could move this and it could light a light bulb or it could whatever. It's generating an EMF which is coming out at this end. There is an EMF, I shouldn't say it comes out, it's not like current to current flows. But what's interesting is if I now connect this up to this one, again there's two or three different uh, concepts we can throw out here. Uh, you want to hold that there, Reese, just like that. You want to see the light bulb. A couple of things. I'm turning it. So now there's electrical current passing through here, and this device is therefore no longer a generator, it is now. If you've got electrical energy going in and mechanical energy coming out? Engine, motor. Motor. Yeah, so this is basically a motor. Electrical energy going in, mechanical energy going out. Now, two things. If I was to disconnect this part of it, the light bulb would be less bright or more bright? Less. More. More, because your electrical energy is going, it's been divided two ways. It's going to be divided between making this handle turn around and the light bulb. So if you were to disconnect either one, the other one will work much better. So it's not obvious, but at this stage, if I disconnected the light bulb, it would actually be much easier, and I can leave it in there, but just disconnect it hopefully. And it's not obvious, but it's much easier to turn this because the energy isn't being used up by the light bulb, so I don't need as much energy to just turn the handle on. So I'm going to put the light bulb back in one last time. All we're doing. Putting the same amount of energy in at my, my end, it's not, it is now running both the light bulb and the handle there at the end. So it just shows conservation of energy. You can't get more energy out than what you're putting in. Simple